The first thing you do when you want to set up your Chromebook is you take the plug and you put it in to the big circle on the side of your Chromebook. And then you take the other end of the cord and you plug it into the outlet in the wall. And once you do that, this light will come on and the light on the plug will come on to show you that the computer's on. So then when you want to open your Chromebook, you just lift up the top like that. And this one turned on automatically. If it doesn't turn on automatically, this button right here is the power button and you can press that button and the power should come on. So this is the first screen that you'll see and this is the sign in window um, but you want to click on this circle down here that says browse as a guest. To click on that, you first need to be able to move around this arrow. And you move that arrow using this trackpad and you just use your finger on it. And where, you know, however you move your finger, you'll move the arrow around. So if you want the arrow to come down or go up. And so we're going to move the arrow down to this uh, oval and then we're going to click. And when you click, you take your finger and you just press down. And you might, you'll hear it go click and then it looks like it's turning off but then this window will come up and once you're on this window now you can um, go wherever you would like on the web so this oval right here this long oval is where you're going to type in where you want to go so if you want to go to gmail you're going to type g m and you're using the letters on the keyboard a i l so it says gmail now and so once you have that, then you're going to come here to this button that says enter. You see that? And so if I click that, then it will search for Gmail. And once I come here, um, if Gmail is my, it, where my email is, then I can go to sign in and click sign in. And now it'll ask for my uh, email address within Gmail. If you don't have Gmail and you have Yahoo, then instead of typing Gmail up here, you would type Yahoo and it will take you to the sign in for Yahoo. If you want to get another window, you press on this plus sign. And now I have a new window I can search from. Say I want to go to YouTube, I'm going to type in YouTube, T U B E. And same thing, I'm going to press the enter button. And so now this will take me to YouTube. If I click on here, it will take me to YouTube. And then if I want to search, this box says search. So if I want to search for a particular teacher or a video that I know is there, I can type it in there and it will search through YouTube. I can go click back over here and that will take me back to Gmail. So now once I have two windows up, I can go back and forth between the two windows. Once you have your email up, you'll be able to find your email that has a link to the pre-K platform and click on the link and it will come up automatically. I just wanna show you a couple other things. If you click on these three buttons, this window comes up and this is another way where you can get a new window or a new tab. Um, if you're downloading something, this is where you would download it, then it would go onto this, the hard drive on this computer. It's really hard to see. And then down here, if you click on this oval, this is how you turn the power off or you can exit as a guest. But then I also just wanted to show you down here, this is how you can turn up the sound. And then this is how you can turn up or down the brightness on the computer. And that's it. Hopefully you'll be good to go.